In this video, we're going to go over how to upgrade your Elasticsearch or OpenSearch cluster using the Opster Management Console. Once you have a cluster up and running, it's going to look like this. We have a full video on how to spin up clusters using the console, so if you want directions on that step, check out our other video. Looking at this cluster that's already up and running, we can see that it's working by calling any of these API calls. So the cluster has seven nodes, two data nodes, and some active shards and data. So let's get right to upgrading our cluster. We're going to switch over to cluster view, go to actions, and select upgrade cluster version. We can see that the current cluster version is 2.0, so let's upgrade it to 2.1. Just click upgrade, we'll get this pop up, and then we'll be able to see that some processes have started we can see that some ports have been restarted. It's going to take a few minutes to finish updating and restarting, but in the meantime, let's take a look at the YAML file. We can see that it's been updated and the CRD of the cluster has changed. The version is now 2.1. We can take a look at the Kubernetes activities and see that the nodes are being replaced. The rest of the process is automatic. All that we needed to do was press the upgrade version button earlier so now we'll just check back in in a few minutes and see that the version is updated. The console will take care of restarting the nodes and upgrading the version for you, but it's important to keep in mind that you still need to take care of the application. Remember to check the data stored in Elasticsearch or OpenSearch and the API calls you need to run to make sure everything is future compatible and there are no breaking changes. This way you can be sure the application will work with the newer version. Okay, so it's been a few minutes and now we see that most of the nodes have been restarted and are being replaced like the master nodes. If we want to see the current status, we can see here in the Kubernetes activity that the last master has been restarted. If we want to check the updated version, we can run a get on the cluster and we can see now that the number is 2.1. Amazing. So the nodes have been replaced. There is still, as we can see here, one master node being restarted. So let's do cat nodes and check. There is still a node that needs to connect and it just connected. Now we can see it here. So now there are three masters, two data nodes and two ingest nodes all in the newer version. And that's it. It's super easy to upgrade Elasticsearch and OpenSearch versions using the Opster Management Console. If you have any questions or need help, just reach out to the Opster team.